And it is a first alert day again. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Marsha Lenz. This time, a winter storm could leave half a foot of snow, freezing rain, and high winds. It already has some schools dismissing early. Now we're going to check in with meteorologist Cedric Haynes to find out a little bit more about when this snow is expected to begin. Hi, Cedric. Here we go again. Yes, Marsha. Yes, this is like our winter storm number seven, eight. I, I've lost count, <laughs> but to. yes, it is on the way, folks it is bearing down on the area as we speak and it will be moving in over the next several hours. So let me show you the radar picture right now because we have light snow developing just south and west of Mount Pleasant, Burlington now making its way in Keokuk. You're starting to see some of those snowflakes flying but look off to the south and west. The area of low pressure, the main storm center, still way off into western Kansas so we've got a ways to go but you can see the moisture riding up and over that front into the colder air mass and eventually that's going to lead to snow and a wintry mix this evening. So let me walk you through the timing of this here. Here we are now. You can see clouds thickening up across the area with a breezy easterly wind. You probably noticed that if you've been outside, but we are dry. But notice the snow moving in close to the I-80 corridor as early as about 3 o'clock. So from Iowa City towards the Quad Cities and Princeton and South, it'll already be snowing, and then that snow will overspread the rest of the area through the late afternoon into the evening hours. It could be heavy at times with those breezy winds. And then tonight, we'll try to get some warm air in here, so we may see that mix over to some freezing rain and sleet or even just some cold rain across the far south east before more colder air wraps in on the backside of the system Tuesday morning, bringing us yet more snow and also some wind before it wraps up by lunchtime in the afternoon. So overall, we've got a winter storm warning for areas along and north and west of the I-80 corridor where we could see the heaviest snow with winter weather advisories off to the south of that. Again, as you head north of the I-80 corridor, we're talking six to eight inches plus of snow moving in across the area with three to six inches of snow likely right here in the metro and right along the I-80 corridor and about one to three inches of snow off towards the south with maybe a little sleet or freezing rain mixing in as well, and that will help to cut down on the totals. But again, this system will be making its way into the area as you go between now all the way up through about 4 or 5 o'clock. And once it hits, this afternoon's commute is going to be quite messy. Marsha.